finishing up my walk. I did, I think it was three miles. I was walking for an hour. I have my fake TJ Maxx ear pods in. They're actually pretty good. They're not bad and they're lasting. The battery power is lasting. I've had some fake ones before and these are actually pretty good. People walking by and they were gonna think I was crazy for, for vlogging hours today. I did like a full body, full sort of full body. Um, then I did some booty band and I was like, I wanna get some cardio in. All right guys, here is my workout outfit. I wanted to show you. Um, our pants are my obsession. Oh my goodness, they have that crocodile pattern. I think I showed these to you guys. I think I did. Maybe I didn't, but they have this like alligator, whatever <laughs> pattern on them. They are so soft and comfortable. I think they were $16.99 and I just love the workout pants at TJ Maxx. Like they're amazing. I feel like these are so high quality and they're really flattering because they're high waisted. Then this top is from the Marilyn Monroe collection or whatever. I showed it to you guys maybe like a few weeks ago. It's a three pack for $14.99. I wear these all the time. There are little pads in them. I keep the pads in the black one. Um, the other ones, I took the pads out because it was kind of see-through. Um, but this one, I just leave the pads in and I don't wear it with a bra. So, um, so cute. I love how this looks together. And then I'm wearing my favorite Walmart sneakers that are a dupe for the Adidas. My socks look a little dorky because they're a little higher, but I just wanted to show you guys. This has been like my go-to workout outfit. I'm so happy lately with my skin. I haven't even been wanting to wear makeup because I'm just so happy with the way my skin looks. Um, so I want to do a whole video, like my main channel with my nice camera on things I'm using, like supplements and stuff to help my skin. Um, you guys can see like everything. I don't know. It just I feel like it's so clear. I feel like my pores are so much better. I feel super hydrated and glowy. So I'm going to do a whole video because there are so many things I'm taking that are helping my skin. Um, also, I got a new bike, which I'm so excited about. It's a Kent. It's so beautiful. I haven't rode it yet. I just got it last night at Walmart. The workers were so sweet and they were able to put the bike in my car. Like they worked really hard to get it in. I thought it was going to be in a box and it wasn't. I will show you guys when I go on a bike ride. It is so beautiful. Um, I got another bike because I wanted one that was seven speed because where I live is really windy. I live by the water, so it's hard to have a single speed bike because you feel like you cannot move at all. This was literally the only bike that they had. I think I got the last one. I ordered it online and then I picked it up. I drove like 50 minutes away to a further Walmart. The price was amazing. It was like $120 crazy good price and yeah so I'm so excited to show you guys my new bike and also I just got a message an email that my vlog camera was delivered um, I got one used on Mercari you guys know or maybe you don't know I like buying things used save money that way um, I like to be conservative and I got an amazing deal it's the one upgraded from the one I have now so it's the Sony a5100 which is an amazing camera you can change the lenses Here she is my new baby oh it came so quick I ordered this literally it was like a day ago and she lives in Jersey so that's why it shipped so quick the girl who sold it to me so that was awesome so here it is and I was hoping it would come quickly too so I could use it because I was so excited and it's the white one, which I, of course, was like, I loved the white one, so I was really excited. I wouldn't have cared if it was black, because I currently had a black, but just the fact that it is makes it even better. So this is the kit lens, the one it comes with. She had the original box. Um, I will save this. I didn't save my original box, but you really should save the box in case you ever sell. And then this is the brand new lens that was included with it basically for free. So this is like $300 lens. It's the E50 millimeter f1.8. So it gives a nice blurry background. Um, this one I won't use for like self vlogging um, or when I'm at the stores. This will be for filming videos like for my channel and also filming my Instagram videos. I will use this one and I just put it on quick. I put it away in here because I didn't want anything to happen to it. I'm trying to be more careful than I was previously. Here it is. It is a beautiful, beautiful quality lens. Sony, because I already had one, it's literally the same as the E5000. Uh, sorry, the A5000. Um, it just has the higher megapixels and it's a lot smoother and it's just 
such nice quality. I'm so happy with it. It even has the strap which my other one didn't have. And I just have to be very gentle with this one and not drop it and not throw it in my bag and treat it like a piece of junk like I was doing before to start vlogging with this one. And of course it has the really nice flip up screen like my other one had. I was going back and forth between getting this one or that new Sony, it's called the ZV-1. It's a vlogging camera. They specifically made it for content creators. So many people have been saying it's amazing and it really is amazing. I've seen so many videos of samples because I always do my research before I buy anything. I was going to get it. I had it in my Amazon cart. It was going back and forth and then I, it was like $800 and I'm just like, you know what? I don't need that one. It's too much money. I need to be conservative. I'm, <laughs> you know, definitely, especially during this time. And I just didn't want to make any ridiculous choice like that to spend so much money. Although I loved the camera and thought the quality is beautiful. I think this one was a way better deal for me. I waited for the right one. I got it used. It's excellent quality. Um, I cleaned it up a little. The parts that I could wipe down, I wiped down and sanitized. I cleaned up the lens. I used a soft cloth. Um, just made sure it was all clean and it is beautiful quality. There's no scratches, dents, or anything like that. So I highly recommend going on Mercari or eBay and looking for used electronics that are in good quality condition. Um, it'll help you save a lot of money. And I even got that lens. So great deal. I saved so much money and I didn't have to get the ZV-1. And on that one, you can't change the lens. Whereas this one, you can. So it gives me so many more options and I feel like with the 50 millimeter the quality looks just as good as that one so there is my little money saving tip for you guys hey guys I'm at Trader Joe's and I'm seeing some holiday stuff popping up like the hot cocoa spoon these are only 99 cents so I'm so excited. I really wanted to try this. So I'm excited. There's holiday stuff coming out. We got some hot cocoa mix. Collagen I actually really like. You can get it at Trader Joe's. It's only $10. And I think it is really good. Definitely check this out if you're looking for a collagen. There's so many amazing benefits for your health and for your body, hair, and skin. So I just went to, like you guys saw, Trader Joe's, BJ's, got some food. About to head back home and make breakfast. I did stop at Dunkin even though I was like I'm not gonna get coffee so I was like okay one day a week get a coffee so I got Dunkin I tried something different today and you guys are gonna laugh at me what I do is I go to YouTube and I type in like Dunkin orders and I just read the comments and see what people order and then I order that <laughs> I don't know does anyone else do that I like finding out new drink orders and by the way it is freezing out so I am like all bundled up I have on like 50 different patterns right now and I look absolutely insane but that's okay because it's so cold it's 39 degrees you guys like we're heading into November and it's already starting to get freezing I want to film an Instagram video today and then I also want to film a YouTube video for like my Sephora wish list so that's the agenda all right guys, so I'm gonna show you what I got at Trader Joe's. So I picked up these Stevia packets. I literally just ran out of these, but I love these. I use them all the time. So those are like a staple. Um, what else? Let's see, I got this almond beverage. This is the unsweetened vanilla. Um, I go through these so quick because I use these all the time in like smoothies and um, what else like my coffee and stuff so I really like that one I like I'm not loyal to like one almond milk so if whatever I find I just get these oh my gosh you guys I'm so excited about these just put out the Trader Joe's Christmas stuff so this was the one I wanted the most they're the dark chocolate covered peppermint Jojo's so I showed you guys a bunch of the stuff that they had there and these I don't think I've ever tried these before but honestly it looks like an Oreo wrapped in peppermint goodness and chocolate so I'm real excited. <laughs> got that like one holiday item. I didn't go crazy with the holiday stuff even though I wanted to. I got the organic coconut aminos. This is a healthier soy sauce. So I'll show you guys the ingredients. It's coconut sap, water, and sea salt. Can you guys see that? So honestly these are, this is so good. It's actually tastes even better than soy sauce because it has like a little bit of sweetness to it so try this out it's delicious with um, like sushi and rice and any sort of like uh, Asian I guess inspired meal 
this which is my new favorite it's the beefless ground beef so i just like this i like the way it tastes um i don't like avoid meat but for some reason this is just easy for me to cook i don't have to like defrost meat i could just keep it in my fridge and then it's already cooked so i just heat it up on the stove and it tastes delicious and it actually has like a lot of good uh vitamins in it you guys see so i highly recommend this it tastes delish like mexican bowl meals um i got this rice it's actually really good the basmati rice two gala gala apples and i also got two avocados then i got these fresh large brown cage-free eggs we had just run out of eggs some broccoli florets those are good too um, I've talked about these so many times, the almond mozzarella shreds. I just got these when I ran out of my other ones so because I'm like half done with the other bag. These are so good. They have like a really nice doughy taste to them, and I just think they're delicious. And this is Trader Joe's brand. Try these out, you guys, even if you're not like avoiding cheese. Um, it's just really yummy. And I got the vanilla non-dairy frozen dessert made with almonds. This is so good. It's The only downside is that it's small. It's like one of those little tiny <laughs> ice creams, but... This is delicious. Love for making our own poke, poke bowls, whatever you want to call them. This is the everything with the bagel smoked salmon. It's so good. You just have it with some rice, avocado, and everything but the bagel seasoning. You can throw in some um, cucumbers and it's delicious. This one is a classic favorite, the mandarin orange chicken. We love this. It's delicious. And I got some brown chicken. And I got two bags of my favorite rice, Chinese fried rice. This is so, so good, you guys. I like this way better than the chicken fried rice. Paul, I see, oh my gosh, I have to charge my, uh, my vlog camera, it's dying. So yeah, that's what I got, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what's your favorite uh, Christmas item at Trader Joe's. Those chocolate Jojo's, I'm definitely gonna try those tonight. They look so good. Um, that is it. Hyper? Are you so hyper? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey guys, so it is pretty dark out right now. <laughs> it is 5.30. I just got to the mall because I want to go to the Sephora sale. So there's a freestanding Sephora that's really close to me that I love, but they don't have Charlotte Tilbury there. And there is a specific Charlotte Tilbury product that was on my wish list that I really want. So I had to come and schlep to the mall and literally coming to the mall sometimes makes me physically ill. Like I get dizzy, but I braved it because I wanted to go to Sephora, Bath and Body Works. And I also wanted to go to Zara because there's a fragrance there that I want. But I just, I get so nervous coming to the mall because this mall is huge and I feel like I don't know where anything is anymore because I never come here. <laughs> I know where Sephora is, but Bath and Body Works, I'm just like a little nervous because you have to walk so far. And, oh my gosh. And I also can't handle it. It's so dark out. My husband was telling me I was so dramatic before because I'm like, I can't take it. It's so dark out so early. And he's like, you've been doing this for 30 years. And I was like, I know, but it's just, it's different now. Okay. Like, I don't know. I can't take it. It makes the day seem so much shorter. And especially when you take a lot of pictures for like blogging and stuff, I have to like time everything so I can like get my pictures in the sunlight and stuff. I know this is like, so I'm, I am being dramatic right now. I, I admit. Um, so yeah, let's go into the mall and probably we'll just be filming. This is my phone camera because my vlog camera is charging at home. So let's go into the mall together.
guys I'm at Target right now. Just left the mall, which was so crazy and so busy. I like couldn't wait to get out of there and come to Target, one of my happy places. So um, I need to pick up some paper towels. What else? Of course, I'm in like the makeup section. The last place I need to be right now. Look at this. Native has holiday deodorants and they have sugar cookie. Oh my goodness, this is a mini. But they actually have the full sizes too. I'm like curious what, are these expensive? I think these are expensive. I tried one once and I didn't like it, but I mean, I'm all for a candy cane deodorant. I mean, that is awesome. I'm gonna get both deodorants and let you guys know which one I like. So, both minis and then I'll show you what else I'm getting. This is a Stevia water enhancer and it's amazing. It tastes like a strawberry, like juicy fruit. And then what you do is you add it to the LaCroix leather. It's amazing, it's so good. So I love these, they're these little like packs of different heart earrings. And then they have different stars. And then I wanna show you guys these like really good dupes for the key high key fade sunglasses from wild fable so these are 15. this top is a little thicker but they're they have the fade and everything definite dupe if you guys are looking for one because the keys are expensive i have a headband obsession these are really like tall and puffy which would probably look ridiculous on me but they also have really cute sunglasses the wild fable like look at these Look how cute these are. I love those. Alright guys, so here's what I'm doing today. This is not like sponsored or anything like that. I just wanted to show you guys because this is so cool. So Ibotta, Ibotta, this is an app that you use. It has a lot of deals and coupons. I highly recommend it because of that. Um, there's lots of like coupons to go along with like your other couponing. But they're actually doing, and I found out about this from my friend on Instagram shop and k-pop so two of the things sold out but mainly everything's here so green beans turkey stuffing uh cranberry sauce a free turkey three pounds you guys that's crazy um mashed potatoes a big thing of coca-cola i don't drink coke but you could always donate this stuff too if you want to do it and then donate it or you can use it for yourself and then the cream of mushroom soup and then the gravy and the onions are sold out but honestly you could probably just get those at Dollar Tree. I saw those there. Um, I think the most awesome thing about this is getting that turkey. Um, so you, what you do is you add them all and then you scan them at the store and then Ibotta will give you all the money back for all the items. I think it comes up to like 19. So for your Thanksgiving dinner, I will link my Ibotta code down below if you guys want to try this out. It's not like a scam or a gimmick or anything. It's like sponsored by, I think, Campbell's and I think maybe Butterball it said, let me see. It says, um, I don't know, it says it's somewhere over there, but it's awesome. And they also have tons of other like bonuses and stuff. So sign up for Ibotta. I know some people don't like, down don't like downloading apps on their phone or whatever, but if you wanna do it and then maybe, I don't know, get rid of it, but I recommend using Ibotta. Um, there's like some of the cream of mushroom. I don't wanna like make it come falling down, but. How do you pull this out? Here we go. Cream of mushroom soup. There's the mix. There's the next one. Yeah, it's only a dollar. All right. Doing good. So well, I can't find any of the stuffing mix. I can only find cornbread and chicken. So I'm just going to get the chicken. I found some turkeys, but I think this is smoked. And I think I'm looking for this one. Turkey breast. It's all smoked. Guys, I got my bird. 12 pounds. They didn't have anything less than 12 pounds, so I just ended up getting that one. In the baking aisle for um, that cranberry sauce, which I can't find yet, but maybe it'll be down here. Right, guys so here's some food stuff I got this is from the Thanksgiving deal and I just already submitted my receipt to Abada and it said it'll appear in my account in three days so you'll get the cash back um guys what are you doing chicken flavored stuffing mix this is the green beans I like ripped the bag open by accident so I closed it the cream of mushroom soup I didn't get the coca-cola because like I don't know I feel like it's just like so unhealthy um it had caffeine in it and I don't know 
I didn't, I didn't get it. Um, the Earth Balance Soy Free Butter. Um, I did not have any butter sticks, so I grabbed this. Everything from here is so cheap too. Um, cornstarch, this was like 96 cents. Um, I use this for making like my own deodorant. So I also got these real bacon pieces. Nick likes those. Some of these dishwasher packs. These are, you get 12 packs and they're like two bucks. I think this is such a good deal. This is like one of my favorite finds today. This is actually in the cleaning section. So not the home section. That's why I could never find this. It's the great value brand three wick candle. This is pumpkin waffles. So I showed this to you guys in the store. This smells exactly like Bath and Body Works pumpkin pecan waffles, which was like one of my favorite candles. But that one, it retails for $24.50. And even if you get it on sale, it's like nine to $10. This one was $4.97, you guys. And I cannot wait to burn this. I still love the fall scents, even though we're going into, I guess, like Christmas scents. And I got a cute couple presents for my nephews for Christmas. This is crazy. I can't believe like... <laughs> It's so close to Christmas. This is just honestly like wow. So I'm like I need to get my life together and start getting some stuff So I got my little nephew Bryce. He is one year old, but he wears 24 months because he's a chunky monkey I got him these these sets from Walmart are so affordable and cute So these are like little gray sweats little sweatshirt. Oh my goodness. This was 450 and it is so cute It's like soft on the inside very soft had matching pants, but they didn't have 24 months and they had 18 months, but I was like, I don't know, like it might be too just right. So I'm going to look at another Walmart for the matching pants. And then I also got him this little top. I liked the color of it. I thought it was cute. This was only $3.98. And then for Blake, he is four. I got him this long sleeve camo shirt. And then I figured he could wear it together. Um, these are like little pants. These were four fifty, and they have the little cuff on the bottom. Oh, so it's, I'm getting busted. Is your head cut off? We are going to be testing the new holiday drinks at Dunkin', and we did this last year, if you guys remember. And they had many more drinks last year. Wait, that was a year ago already? Yeah. Oh they only had two, which I'm like, what the heck? Starbucks has many more, but we did Duncan last year, so I wanted to do Duncan. I wanted to do Duncan again. And if you guys want us to do Starbucks, let us know. We'll do that too. Sounds good. Because they have the eggnog one. Remember last year Duncan had the eggnog one? That was my favorite. They don't have it this year. I think they like kind of cheaped out a little bit. Cheapskates. So Oliver's wanted to join us. Little snuggle buns. Oh yeah, he's so cute. So he wants to help us. So the two flavors we have, and I didn't get the oat milk chai latte because I feel like that's like, I don't know. I wasn't really feeling that. I feel like it's not like a holiday drink. I felt like it was more like a fall drink. Sounds gross anyway. So, oh no, I forgot which is which. Does it say? Yeah. And I put the seasonally appropriate straws in. And <laughs> I got these at Walmart last year. It doesn't say which is which. It'll be a guess, I guess. What were the two flavors? So the two flavors are peppermint mocha, which is like every year, peppermint mocha. They have it and then gingerbread, which I don't think Starbucks has. So I that's the one I was excited the most about, the gingerbread this one. Is probably gingerbread. So I'll just I think that's gingerbread. If so, it's really good. Is that gingerbread? That's gingerbread. I got almond milk in these, just a reference. It's alright. It's alright. Yeah. Did we have I can't remember if they had this last year. I, I don't think they, they did. did. I like it. I think it tastes like gingerbread. Yeah, cinnamon. I was gonna say it doesn't need more cinnamon. I just think it's a little watery. Might have just been the one we got. We had it in the fridge for oh, a few hours. Oh, I smelled it, yeah. Yeah, but I did keep it in the fridge because I got these a few hours ago and then... I'm good. Okay, so then that's a gingerbread. I like it, I think it's good. And this is the peppermint. This is the peppermint, which you guys know the peppermint, they have it all the time. This is definitely peppermint. <laughs> Very sweet. And I'm saying that. The almond milk makes all the drinks sweeter too. Like, come closer. Oh, wow. Very sweet. Yes. I really like this one. I'm a huge peppermint fan. Like I have peppermint creamer all year round, so I love it. I miss my eggnog one. I don't know why they didn't bring the eggnog back. They're Cheap. just very weird. Cheap. They should at least have minimum 
four holiday flavors like sugar cookie eggnog if you're gonna have holiday drinks you need to at least have eggnog and definitely do a sugar cookie because i feel like that would be so popular right like christmas a cookie Oh, and didn't they have a white mocha one last year? Yes, there yeah, was five. Think, like, there was, one there was five. Yeah. Yeah, that was the one. Like when I saw the email. Review the tape. <laughs> we have to go back and look at the last year's review. Because I remember eggnog was your favorite. That feels like it was really yesterday. I'm right? going to say I'm not really a fan of these. I like both of them. I think they're both good. I really like the peppermint, and I think this one is... I like them. I like them both. You can have both of them. I'll probably be saving <laughs> these for tomorrow when I... Although I don't really have caffeine anymore. And these are caffeine. You guys, there's only two drinks. So I think they're really good. I mean, peppermint's classic. Gingerbread is like a nice little treat. I would probably get... I would get both of them again. I know you probably wouldn't, but... I'll stick with my caramel. Yeah, he likes caramel. So let us know if you guys are going to try either of these drinks in the comments and also give this video a thumbs up if you want us to try starbucks too because they have way more these were like the total came to nine something for two smalls yeah so not worth it four what's that 450 per, per this is a small that's not that's not even a medium because it's a latte so the lattes are always more expensive than just like regular iced coffee but I'm wondering, you know, what you could probably do is just get an iced coffee and yeah, add the flavors. Pump, yeah. yeah, I would honestly do that. Save yourself some money. And there's too much in these also, I think. Yeah, so this is the latte. So don't get the latte. Just get your regular iced coffee and get the flavor. I honestly should have did that. But next time. I was being, I don't know why, I was being like a, a newbie rookie. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. Now I just thought of it. All right, so that's our review. I liked them, but... Do the little trick, get the iced coffee. They should have more flavors, and he didn't like them. That's no. the overview. More holiday videos coming soon, and that's it. Bye. Bye. <laughs>